What's up, buttercups? How are you guys doing on this hot golden day? <laughs> It is so hot, I think it's like 100 degrees, but anyway, well, after hun literally hundreds of requests asking me to reveal what bumpers I picked for my Golden 370Z, I'm finally here to uh, answer to your golden questions. So uh, sit back, relax, don't get any popcorn because it's not going to be that long of a video. But uh, first of all, let's go wash the car and then uh, we'll head to revealing the golden bumper. So let's go, three, two, one, Whoop. Everything you said, they already knew, more or less. Well, here's something that you didn't know. You guys think I'm gonna show it to you right away, right? <laughs> Not happening, you have to wait. Actually, I just remembered you could skip to the end if you wanted, but please don't do it. <laughs> Does it for like two seconds. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Oh my gosh, I have not been this hot since Nigeria. <laughs> oh my goodness, it's so hot. But yep, let's go. Oh my gosh, I've missed this car so much. <laughs> Downshift. <laughs> okay guys, it is finally time to fist your eyes on the golden, golden gold. <laughs> yeah <laughs> so a few of you guessed it but i got the golden 370z uh 2015 and above um nismo bumpers oh and i think it looks so good <laughs> oh my goodness i just love the way all the everything it just brings out the lines of the car way more and from the way the front bumper red thingy is let me show you guys the way this thing is oh i love it so much and it's not complete yet so pretty much you you will notice that um uh, pretty much uh, this thing is missing that there's a hole there. That's where the LEDs go and uh, So um, you guys should suggest what LEDs I should get because the original uh, 370z Nismo um, LEDs are too expensive when I tried to get them. They were so expensive and uh, So just suggest which one I should get Because I've seen a few suggestions or I've seen a few online But I'm not sure which to get and I'm not sure because I really want one that's really good for the price and will not like blow up whenever I just use it for like a day so something that's long lasting and something that's not too expensive that'll break the bank so just suggest that but um I got everything I got the full kit the front and the rear bumpers from um what's it called Z1 Motorsports and they are actually like OEM Nissan bumpers so if you can see like they literally match perfectly like I did uh, I did not have to do anything to do with fitment at all like I did not deal with that and it was n actually not too difficult to install actually it was kind of difficult to install <laughs> because I didn't have any experience I've never done this before so in the next video I'll show you guys um, how to install it or in the next few videos that are coming you guys will see the exact process that I went through to install the front and the rear to pretty much convert it to a Nismo 370z and I love it because you never see the 370z Nismos in yellow so it's pretty cool to have like a bumper or the bumpers that do that and pretty much that shows yeah and I think well, I, don't, I still don't know why Nissan didn't make a 370z Nismo with the yellow color and it's also pretty cool because I think the red matches. Just let me know what you guys think. I'm trying to think of what I should do with this red here. If I should leave it and make the car like a yellow, red, and um, black accents or in general. Like, I'm not exactly sure what exactly I should do with it. So just let me know what you guys think. Because, oh my gosh, I just felt a bee. I just heard a bee. Oh my gosh. Anyway, so you guys will notice that there's no red striping there like the Nismo has. That's because... Pretty much uh, they painted everything black, like the lower bumper, <laughs> and so it's not there. So I'm going to have to pr pretty much uh, maybe get like a vinyl wrap and wrap that place red or depending on what color that I go with for the theme that I'm going with. So you guys should just, again, let me know what suggestions you guys have as to what theme I should go with. Maybe if I should go with the yellow, uh, black, and then the red accents around it, because I think the red looks really good. Or maybe if I should go with blue accents instead, maybe I can wrap that red place blue. Oh my gosh, my hand hurts. This uh camera is kind of heavy <laughs> but anyway just let me know what you guys think so z1 motorsports is pretty cool because you can get the whole with all the bumpers uh in a package so they offer it in a package and so it's pretty cool that they do that so you could pretty much get everything so i got um the front fascia 
just like that but they also included the red things they included all the trim bits and everything and so they should suggest that thing to you so i recommend z1 motorsports if you want to do the conversion and again the conversion video will be in my next video so yeah um also uh, oh my hand hurts oh. i also really like the rear too the way these scoopy thingies are or the way the air vents are it looks pretty cool oh my hand actually hurts okay i'm switching hands oh that feels so much better oh. But yeah, <laughs> just let me know what you guys think. I just wanted to make this short video so you guys can, can see exactly what was going on with the 370Z because I think I saw a few comments asking. It pretty much just transforms the look of the 370Z. Like every time I just look back at it, oh, it looks so different and so golden. From each angle, everything is just so nice. And there's one problem though. The rear paint on the rear bumper, it's kind of in like sunset light. It kind of looks a little bit off but in like daylight everything looks really clear like i'm not sure if you guys can see it right now so look you kind of see it a little bit it kind of looks a little bit off but the front bumper pretty much looks spot on so again just let me know what you guys think and if you guys like it if you don't like it i, I, I still like it so yeah that's pretty much what you guys voted i think it was uh in the voting poll that i made it was 75 percent i think that uh, voted to for me to put the nismo bumper on and so yeah here you go you see i listen to you all <laughs> to it because i'm thinking maybe have like red stripes over maybe on the mirrors hello oh yeah oh please don't crash please don't crash oh gosh you lost traction <laughs> i also forgot to tell you exactly how much it cost me so um the whole kit the front the rear bumpers and there are some things you also need to get because the normal um 370z doesn't work for some body components and so you have to get some special things but everything was about seventeen hundred dollars give or take <laughs> it was kind of expensive but you know what you're paying for because everything is pretty much from nissan and so everything fits perfectly it's so good oh i'm so happy with just how much it fits but that's pretty much it thank you all so much for watching this golden video and i'll catch you guys on the next golden drive